26,000 feet up in the air. Come along on a brilliant visual journey through the skies above Japan. From the airport closest to iconic Mount Fuji, we embark. Soar with us to a realm steeped in legend and wonder. On the Wings. Mid-October, and we find ourselves in Shizuoka, nestled in the heart of Japan. The nation's highest peak has just welcomed its first snowcap of the season. Our point of departure, Shizuoka Airport. Inaugurated in 2009, it stands as Japan's most recently constructed gateway to the skies. In addition to domestic routes covering destinations like Hokkaido, Fukuoka and Okinawa, it also offers international flights connecting to Korea and China. On a clear day, one can capture breathtaking photos of the majestic peak. The airline will be flying with came into being alongside this airport's inauguration. Anchored in Shizuoka, it weaves a network between the nation's diverse regions. Today, our destination is Shimane Prefecture's Izumo Airport, home to one of Japan's most iconic shrines. Our departure time is set for 8.30 a.m. The journey to Izumo will be about an hour's flight. We'll be embarking on a 76-passenger-seater compact jet. It's showtime. For a special treat, view the moment of takeoff directly from the cockpit. Right after liftoff, on your left, you'll spot the Shinkansen, that is, the bullet train speeding by. And then, there's Mount Fuji. As we head out to sea, the aircraft makes a sharp right turn. Now, Mount Fuji is on our right. This route gives views of Mount Fuji from both the left and right sides of the aircraft. You can hardly go wrong, no matter which side you sit. Shizuoka is blessed with abundant water resources, thanks to a series of large rivers flowing through it. With a temperate and rainy climate well suited for tea cultivation, it is in fact Japan's top tea producing region. And here we have Lake Hamana, a brackish lagoon where eel farming is a thriving industry. Leaving Shizuoka, we are now entering the neighboring Aichi Prefecture. 
We've now reached cruising altitude at roughly 26,000 feet. In a smaller aircraft like this one, we fly at a lower altitude, affording closer views of the picturesque scenery below. Thirty minutes since departure now, and the drink service begins. The cabin crew pours their spirit of hospitality into every cup they serve. Pleasant air travel simply wouldn't be possible without the support of the professionals on board. Nabuchi Misako, a flight attendant with nine years of experience. When the seatbelt sign goes off, the crew whirls into action, preparing for drink service. On this route, the seatbelt sign is only off for a short 35-minute window. Within this time, they must serve drinks and clean up from start to finish. It's truly a race against the clock. Aromatic green tea brewed in a traditional teapot. Even with limited onboard facilities, they're able to recreate it. In goes the tea bag, followed by steaming water. ま、飛行機の中で作るので、あまり時間がありませんので、短時間でも美味しいお茶が入れられるように、え、バースプーンを使って30秒間かき混ぜます。で、お茶パックを30回ほど、え、叩いて、最後の一滴はゴールデンド
Mount Daisen comes into view. A curious sight appears below. Islands in the lake, connected by roadways over the water. This bridge marks the border from Tottori to Shimane. Below is Matsue, the capital city of Shimane Prefecture, filled with scenic beauty. Once over Lake Shinji, we prepare for the final approach. We'll be touching down on this runway, jutting out into the lake. 100. 50. 40. 30. 20. 10. Izumo Airport is unofficially referred to as the Airport of Destiny, thanks to a famous shrine which is said to bring enmusubi, or fortune, in relationships. In Shimane, the tenth month of the lunar calendar is referred to as Kamiyarizuki, or the month of deities. Deities from all over the country are said to gather for meetings related to destiny. The venue for these meetings is Izumo Oyashiro Grand Shrine, just a 30 minute drive from the airport. Meet our guide for the day. Adachi Kayo, an airline ground staff member, raised in Izumo. Before visiting the main shrine, you purify yourself at the water pavilion by rinsing your hands and mouth with water. The main structure where the deity is enshrined is located at the very end. Along the approach, there are shops offering traditional Izumo dishes to visitors. Dessert is also a specialty of Izumo. Another recommendation of hers is a rest stop that sells local specialties. Thank you for showing us around. Please fly with us again on On the Wings. <laughs>